And here in Connecticut, many in the Jewish community with relatives in the Middle East are worried about their loved ones after this weekend's attacks. News 8's Bob Wilson has more on their concerns from West Hartford. The Jewish community in West Hartford has been watching the images coming out of Israel after Iran launched their attack. They have been talking to their families and friends back home, hearing firsthand the accounts of the air raid sirens and the orders to take shelter. Israelis across the country spent, many of them, most of them, night, the night in the shelter. Uh, there was tremendous fear. There was a buildup. Iran had been threatening this uh, for a number of days now. Uh, and it's uh, terrifying when you have literally hundreds of missiles aimed uh, at your home, at civilians. For Muslims living in Hartford, they also have a deep concern when they see the video from the Middle East, concern for their families and their brothers and sisters as well. Imam Abdullah Marshall says, believing in a religion that was founded on peace, this conflict has been difficult. It's also a religion that seeks to establish justice and safety and security. So seeing what's going on in Palestine and Israel, all the killing, especially the women and the children, you know, the civilians, this is hard for us, you know, and, um, it's a time where we have to implement uh, patience and, and pray for our brothers and sisters there, asking God to, to save them from these, these atrocities that they're facing. It was prevented by a coalition of the U.S., European allies, Arab states, and Israel working in concert. 99% um, of those projectiles were shot down. Incredible technology. But if they had gotten through and caused civilian damage, um, you would have had a, a war in the Middle East. For Imam Abdullah Marshall, he says his mosque in Hartford is constantly talking to people in the community, starting conversations, trying to help people understand the Islamic faith. We have a lot of community outreach programs where we go and we give out literature, we give, uh, we open up a platform, you know, on the streets of Hartford for that back and forth because Islam is often a misunderstood religion. So I asked, what are the chances of peace in the near future? They said they're not sure right now. However, they do believe that Israel will have some type of a measured response to the Iranian attack. In West Hartford, Bob Wilson, News 8.